Prioritizing mental health has been at the forefront of conversations and now across the nation, many organizations are raising awareness for National Suicide Prevention Month. 2822 Sydney Costas has more with one group from Lackawanna County that makes a promise to veterans that they aren't alone. How about a memorial for those who made it through the war but still died before their time? Echoing throughout Veterans Promise in Dixon City, more than 50 names of soldiers who made it home from battle but lost their own fight on the home front. United States Army Sergeant Dave Reagan and Specialist Ray Stender stand at attention as each one is listed. United States Army Sergeant Keith Bowen. For those families, I mean, um, it means United everything States to them Army to know Sergeant that their loved ones, Calabrese. service and their legacies are not tarnished, that they're, they're not less than. Reagan is the founder of the organization that offers outreach to veterans for PTSD, drug and alcohol education, and support to their families. He says especially during Suicide Prevention Awareness Month, they are working to keep their promise to veterans that they're not alone. The service that I provide at Veterans Promise may be uh, even greater you know, of importance here than, than the service I ever provided in a uniform. It's a battle he says he continues to fight for. It's a hard thing to sit here with a camera in my face and say, you know, I, I had some hard times and struggles and uh, I didn't want to be here. Sometimes I still feel that way to this day, truthfully. But I have to fight on. I have too many people that love me and care about me, and I have too many people I'm responsible for. Veterans are at a 57% higher risk of suicide than those who haven't served, leading to more and more resources aimed at helping those in need. The more you talk to people and individuals that you think might be in a situation where they may be struggling, uh, the more help you can be to them. Since its start in 2016, the organization has come up with programs like Major Hugs, where children who lost or are away from their parents receive a teddy bear to also provide support to their families. When she thinks about her father, when she wants to talk to him, when she wants a hug from him or give him a hug or uh, whatever it is, she can have that bear in place of him at this time that since he's gone. It's the year-round 24-7 dedication that reminds veterans, first responders, and anyone fighting their own battles know that they have a community around them. We need help, and it's okay to ask for help. In Dixon City, City Costas, 2822 News. If you or somebody else you know is struggling and in need of support, you can reach out to Veterans Promise or contact the Suicide and Crisis Lifeline by dialing 988.